A lot of users after upgrading to Windows 11 have reported overheating, an issue that can both damage the computer and affect its performance. Hi friends, today's video is about how you can solve the issues with relate to Windows 11 overheating, especially when you are playing games. So watch this video till the end to know how you can reduce the high temperature of your PC. This problem is primarily caused due to the dust builder running multiple applications at once or using any outdated version of Windows. So there are many other things which you need to do to overcome this issue. So let's start with the basic checks. If you are facing an issue with overheating, the first thing you can do is to restart the Windows 11 PC. For restarting, just go to the start from there. Just click on the power menu and then click restart. Now why this restart is important because in many instances it's a particular process or a program running in the background which is overloading the CPU and causing the system to overheat. So a quick solution would be restart the computer to eliminate any such process. But you must understand that rebooting Windows 11 is only a temporary fix. Now the next thing is to make sure that the computer is properly positioned. Any improperly positioned computer is also likely to cause the overheating problem in your Windows 11. If the CPU is positioned such that the hot air from the fan cannot freely exit due to the obstructions or lack of free space, the computer is bound to overheat. So avoid your laptop resting it on bed or similar surface since the hot air is released from the bottom surface. Also, you can use the cooling pads to keep the overheating in check and enhance the computer's performance. Now, the next basic thing you can try is to check the computer fan. If the computer fan is functioning at a reduced speed or ceases to work together, the system will overheat. This could be due to the dust buildup inside the fan, wire causing obstruction or faulty motor in case the fan does not work. And obviously the issues with the computer fan are easily fixable. Now the fourth basic thing you can try is to update the Windows 11. For updating the Windows 11 just go to the start from there to the settings. And from the left pane just go to Windows update and check if you have a pending update available in your Windows update. And if it's there go and update it. That's it. Now the next fifth solution is to disable startup apps. For that you have to head to task manager. You can go and get it from the start search for task manager or just right click on the start menu. And from here just look for task manager you will get it here. Just click on the task manager. And from here just navigate to start up apps you can see it here just click on that and from here you can disable or remove the apps from here you can see the status if it is enabled just right click on it and you can click disable here you can see a bunch of apps on this pc that loads when you turn it on apart from unnecessary hogging the system resources and leading to overheating this also increase the time taken by windows to boot simple solution is to find those apps that is not unnecessary for your system and then disable these apps. Do remember that not to remove all the apps that appears in the startup types since some performs critical functions. After you have done uninstalling the apps, unnecessary apps, you have to restart the computer and check if the overheating problem in Windows is resolved. That's it. Now the sixth solution is to terminate apps and process. For that, again you have to go to the task manager. Now just click on performance tab and see how your system is performing. And if it is critical, just go to the process. From here you will get the list of process that is running right now and you will be able to understand which process is taking too much of CPU and memory. And from here, if you find something is critical and which is not usable for you, you can right click on that task and click on end task this will temporarily disable that task from running right now and you will be able to reduce the cpu usage if you are facing issues with overheating in windows 11 eliminate this task will come in handy and resolve the problem so once that is done you can close down this window 
Now the next solution, the seventh one is to disable apps from running in the background. For that, you have to go to the start from there, go to the system settings. Now from here, you have to go to apps. Now just click on installed apps. Now you have to locate the app that you do not want running in the background. Now to do that, just click on the ellipsis and then click on advanced option. Now just scroll down to see the background app permission and then click on the drop down and make it never. So this won't allow the app to run in the background. In similar way, you can disable other apps from running in the background. That's it. You can close down this window. Now the eighth solution is to change power plant settings. Now to open the control panel, just click on the start. From there, click on the search and type in control. You will get it here. Just open control panel. Then click on power options. Now you can change it to balance state. Then click on change plan settings. Now then again click on change advanced power settings. Now from here look for multimedia settings. I'll share the screenshot in this video. On how you can make the settings. Which I have copied it from my other system. So please follow the process as you see on the video right now. Now once the process is complete, you can close down the window. Now the ninth solution is to update your graphics driver. For that, just you have to go to device manager. For that, just right click on the start and click on device manager. And from here, just go to display adapter. Now right click on the graphics. Then click on update driver. That will start searching for the updated one. If you have anything new available, then get it installed and see if the issues get solved. So hope these solutions will be able to avoid overheating into your Windows 11 PC along with boosting the system performance. So thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.